I mean, technically, this could be the intro. Yeah, technically, it could. I like the whole kind of just come in on it and let's roll. I don't want to sit there and do the, well, hi, how you doing? We're going to, today's episode, we're going to get up and gears and stuff and yeah. Get, get. You know, that actually works really well with that shirt. <laughs> I would like to, if I may, take you on a journey. A journey to the spark of good intention. Loss within the vacuum of madness. While it is true, they had at least some mechanical aptitude that would not prevent them from going on a night of exploration. A night, hopefully, they would never forget. Let's see here. <laughs> Notice the casual marking out of my name and address because doxing happens. <sighs> There we go. Man, all this stuff is hard to do for me. Okay. We've got it open. Uh, oh, there's my receipt. Yes. We have muffler. Ooh. I flow muffler too. Very nice. Ah. Uh, Oh, that is a pretty exhaust header. Look at me setting the metal exhaust parts on a glass table. <laughs> oh, good. Gasket set. That'll give us the ability to get in that motor, look around, strengthen some things, take out some things, you know, fun stuff. It's a brace bar, I believe. So Corey and my other friend Levi are gonna be here later on today, and we're gonna start breaking into the motor and looking around, putting that stuff on. Let's first actually practice some safety practices. All right, so first things first, safety. Yes, uh, number one safety rule. I am not a professional. I do not know what I'm doing. I'm messing around. Don't copy me. Don't, no human being should copy what I'm doing. It's, Especially that hair. <laughs> I know, it's terrible. But seriously, this is for entertainment and for fun. If you do anything, it's at your own risk. And for anyone that's wondering, we have no gimbal. I'm literally just resting this on my chest. <laughs> wow, it's actually working well. Yeah, it's not bad. Righty tighty, lefty loosey, Johnny. Yep. We're Give gonna, it here. We're gonna try hitting it. Wait, this is this is right. This is right. This is. Right. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's a mother. Screw. There we go. see what the oil looks like before we do hang it just enough on the side uh, let's see this hasn't run long at all Maybe about 30 minutes total I think 30 to 45 minutes total looks pretty clean mm-hmm looks no wait it looks cloudy Hmm. Is it just the mixture of ethanol? Yeah, it could be that it's uh, <coughs> ethanol blowing back into it. We'll take a look. Looks like Levi's here. Say hi, Levi. Hi, Levi. How does this work? So, it looks like yeah, it ran just enough for a little bit of gasket to melt off on there, too. Not bad. But this is some really, look at how restrictive that is. It just comes down. You don't get any airflow at all. It's smaller than my EGR valve. <laughs> yeah, right. And next step. Go ahead and get the tank off. Right, get a shot of that. That is the governor arm right here. And the that's pen. the governor pin. <laughs> yep. It's it's the governor of the whole state of the machine. 
technically. Now, it doesn't actually function really anymore, but it does slow things down because there's still a gear <laughs> grinding along, or turning along with the crankshaft. Yeah, so, grinding gears are bad. Yeah, grinding gears are bad. So, Is there just, anything called the Abbott in there? The Abbott? Well, I was going to say, because then that would be the Governor Abbott. Uh -huh. Oh, that would have been good. That would have been. That would have been, but alas, it wasn't so good. Maybe we should call this tool time, like, and just <laughs> literally just be, this is how you don't use tools for their intended purposes. <laughs> right, yeah. Exhibit A, don't use a pry bar like that. Now we are going to, man, I did not want to have to take off the carb. Why did I take the carb off? Is it attached? Well, I mean, ah, all right. If I turn it this way, are you holding that like a parrot? <laughs> That's awesome. Get it you get before you get to my neck. Or hold the camera. <laughs> this is Corey. This segment called Can We Beat Levi to His Car? <laughs> and we beat Levi! He, he grabbed it and didn't want to be beaten, so. Oh. He undid it. Well, I mean, this battery's pretty heavy. You can still be beaten. <laughs> well, also, at that point, it'd just be easier to. And hand tightening or hand untightening. Yeah, go for it. Oops. How many guys does it take to unscrew you? Some things can't be unscrewed. The Levi is faster. Damn it. Oh, yeah, we're gonna need that. <laughs> <laughs> like that. Hey, just that. because you're fast doesn't mean you're accurate. <laughs> Come straight up with it. You should be able to save the gasket. There it goes. Come on. Aha. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah. Yeah, I have a new one. It's okay. And this is our new band artwork right here. <laughs> right? Uh, can you do me a favor, Levi? Let's see if we can do this. I need a light shining in there, and I also want a close-up camera shining in there. We want to check and see if there's any anything bad going on. Do you know how to spot if there's anything bad? Mm-hmm. We just want to see if there's any corrosion or if there's any flakes of metal, like anything. There's a lot of oil. Yeah, that's a good. <laughs> that's a good thing. That's our cam. Looks like there's some uneven wear on the. No, no, it's, it's just that's that the machining, yeah. right? Uh, it's the machining. Right? Okay, so here are the two things that we're going to take out. This governor arm, which I don't believe will come out on its own. Yeah, I'm gonna have to cut this. So, <laughs> Levi, would you do me a favor and plug in my Dremel? Tune into the next episode of how not to use this shit. There we go. Oh, it's close. I'm gonna just shave it a couple millimeters off. It's so close though. I, I've seen this done. I know it can. Yeah, but I think you were still in just a little bit. So, like, can you push it back all the way? Yep. There's still some left. Again. Not how you're supposed to use this. Got it. You're right, Corey. I needed that extra little. Bit. 
And that's your tax dollars right there. <laughs> that's a governor. Okay, also, we need to make sure you get this because that will fall in there and grind up on all those gears and it will be tragic. Okay, next step is to get that out. What is that? That is the governor wheel. That thing spins around and it throws weights out of it. You see these weights right here? It spins around and it throws these weights and then it makes this little thing right here push up or push against that lever that we just took out and then that lever closes down the stock carburetor so it only stays at 3800. Yay, max. conservation of momentum. <laughs> I need a bright light. Somebody wants to just cut it because this is just a plastic gear. Yeah. Just well, I mean, what we could do is if we had uh, a tiny enough uh, thing, we could just go in and cut that. You want to give me the uh, drummer? <sighs> That'd be dangerous. I can get it. You sure. <laughs> Let's see. Ah, and that. I want it. Well, oh my God! What? We have, look at this. There's metal shavings everywhere. We're never gonna get out of this. Uh, there is a way. Mm hmm. Aside from just like. Filling the damn thing up, flushing it, filling it up, flushing it. It won't be in there for long. Mm -hmm. Let's hit it with the hose. What? You're gonna. Why would you do that? Why would he do that? Yeah, I mean, everything's covered in oil anyway. Yeah, so hit it with the hose, we'll get it out, and then we're gonna throw oil back in it anyway. Yeah. <laughs>